I mean, uh, the honest truth is that the vice president delivered a master class. I mean, I'm not sure there's anybody who's been following uh, the Ghanaian political landscape in the last 12 to 16 years that does not know that. And I mean, those people who were basically egging him on, actually, for me, today have been given um, the 101 uh, when it comes to economics. And the truth of the matter is that, like he said, economics is a size. I mean, really, it's, you deal with data. And you can't take away from the basic tenets of what an economic indicator is and how well an economy is doing and use your own analysis and even uh, have a clear departure from a certain situation analysis. I mean, and he made mention of the reasons and the issues that's actually bedeviling the global economic landscape and created a, a, a situation where he did a comparative analysis of where we are today and that of the NDC in their previous eight-year uh, tenor. So the reality is, is clear. I mean, he also was very forthright. He admitted that, yes, we are facing challenges, but also got, went ahead to actually explain to everybody what government is doing and the sort of measures that's been put in place to revitalize the economy and all that with the Ghana Care, the Batampa uh, program and all, a host of other things. And it was also clear that all those people who were calling for, oh, how do you account for the loans and the fiscal deficit and all that, you also give us a list of all the things that uh, these loans have been used for. So as far as I'm concerned, I mean, um, I'm actually not surprised that he, de he delivered a masterclass.